Hey, Steve here. Today I want to talk about Black Lives Matter, and I do want to say a little bit on the game industry's response and some of my thoughts on that, but I'm going to try to keep it brief. The first thing that I want to say is that I recognize that I am white and have lived with white privilege my whole life, so I will never truly know the perspective of a black American. All I want is to try to understand it and offer my support. The Rixie label has already voiced their support, but I personally want to reiterate that there is no question about it. Black lives do in fact matter. I wish this wasn't something we'd have to talk about, and if you don't think it's an issue, I ask you to look around at what's been happening in our communities. It's never stopped being an issue. And it isn't a political issue. It's a question of human rights. It's about the value of a person. What happened to George Floyd was a horrific tragedy, and not to minimize that, but it is just the straw that broke the camel's back. Breonna Taylor, Ahmaud Arbery, and so many more have been killed for no reason. People are protesting because the system has failed too many times. To show we need change. We need reform. But whether or not you join a protest, I ask that you vote for policies and government officials that will support that reform. Police brutality is unacceptable, and those officers who unjustly hurt and kill others need to be held accountable as any civilian would be. And it should go without saying, but racism is also unacceptable across the board, both in everyday life as well as within our justice system. The only race is the human race, and that needs to be recognized. So do what you can to promote that. Protest, donate, vote, whatever you can do to help make a difference. Let your local government know your stance. And now to talk about this in the context of the game industry a bit. As a whole, It's been supportive of the Black Lives Matter movement. Basically, every company and outlet has made a statement, and I'm glad to see that. Numerous gaming events planned are being postponed so as not to take the spotlight off of what's going on. You can look up the new dates, though don't be surprised if some get postponed further. In the end, I just hope these companies back their words with action in some way. And what I think is the most important place to act is within the gaming communities. Video games should be a place for escapism and enjoyment to get away from whatever you're dealing with in your personal life. But gaming communities, unfortunately, can be very toxic. It isn't just one company, so I don't want to call out a single one in particular, but as an example, Activision Blizzard has said they're supporting the movement and that they're going to clean up some of the racism in their communities. And that's great, but I ask, where have they been? Call of Duty is popular, but it is also one of the most notorious for heavy racism in chat and has been for over a decade. And on a slightly separate note, just this last year, Blizzard had banned Chung Blitz Chung from competitive Hearthstone for supporting the Hong Kong protests. They can say what they want about keeping politics out of their events, but again, it isn't political, it's human rights. And it's upsetting that they actively put that down. I just think companies need to make sure that they are doing their best to promote positivity and equality in their communities. But that doesn't stop with them. It also applies to the people in these communities. So I ask you to be positive and don't feed into those who are negative. Just put it down. Call it out and report it when you see it. Don't accept discrimination in your hobbies. We all need to do our part to keep this medium that we love so much a space for everyone to freely enjoy it, without fear of being excluded or insulted for who they are. And at the risk of going on anymore, I'm going to end it here. If you've made it this long, thank you for listening. Now go listen to people who are better educated on the issue than I am.